Hi, welcome back to ODE YouTube channel and welcome to another unboxing. Today I'm going to open this box that I received from Spain. And I received this from a store in Barcelona which is called Fontana Pena. Uh, there is inside something that I bought and also a little gift. So, let's open it and I'll show to you what is inside. This is a much weighted pen for me and I think for many people around the world but the release of this pen was delayed so we had to wait. Here we have my trusty Victorinox Solo knife that I use for my unboxing videos and let's try to figure out how this box will open okay like that so let's put the knife here sorry I'm always hitting the camera I have a better setup now not to, to hit the camera as often but I'm so clumsy that I do it anyway. So, done. Okay. As usually, the yellow, orangey uh, little card from the, the, an envelope with the, the invoice and all the payment information there. It's not necessary for this video. And then we have this protected by paper and also by bubble wrap. And let's take the box out of the way and let's see inside this wrap what we have. The first thing we have, and I'm going to show it right now, is this little thing. You remember? Some time ago I made a review where I talked about this. This is a, an interesting item. I don't know if that's that useful. I think it's just funny to have. This is a Caveco. Do you send out dispenser that you do like this? And you take ink cartridges from inside. You do this and they pop out, which is a funny funny, maybe silly thing to do. Okay, this may be useful if you are going on a trip and you want to take some ink cartridges. You can also take a little box, but this makes everything much, much funnier. And you can say, if I have one, why am I so excited to receive another? Because the one I have is a black one, and this is a silver one that I didn't have. And now, I want to have the blue one because I know there, there was a blue one around and I need one of the blue, uh, the blue version. If anyone knows, oops, if anyone knows about the blue version of this one being sold anywhere, mainly in Europe, please let me know because I really, really, really want to have this little thing in blue. So, thank you so much for Fontana Pena for sending me this gift along with the pen. The pen was not a gift, I bought it, but I bought it at some discount. So, thank you also. And let's open this. And here you have it. Let's take this aside. Let's close the knife. And what we have here is the Platinum Curidas. In Portuguese my, my tongue wants to say Curidas because that's the way we pronounce things, but I think it's strange and all the mentions I saw were Curidas. So, let's go for it. This is a pen that I was quite interested in because I find 
the cupless pens to be very, very interesting. I have several pilot cupless. I have also a Chinese imitation or inspiration of uh, uh, a pilot cupless, which is the Dagong 56. I'm not sure. And now I have this one. I also would like to have a pilot fermo and I would like to have the Lamy dialogue and okay. <laughs> and I think Visconti also has a retractable pen. So I would like to have them all but one at a time. But I saw this one and I saw this pen being presented like a cheaper and more efficient alternative to the to the pilot. Let's see how it looks. So, here I have mine. This is a pen that costs around 60 euros. It comes inside this plastic little sleeve. It comes with a planet, platinum uh, ink cartridge, which they are very fun because they bring a very big metal ball to, to seal the cartridge. And they have here, I suppose, no. I, I thought there would be some papers or some information, but nothing beneath that. So, let me take this out of the way. So, this is a cheaper version of the, the, the Pilot. And I can see it is a bigger pen, but uh, a little bit... It's girthier and it is much longer than the Pilot. At least, that's what it seems to be. I'll make a review of this pen, obviously. Uh, that's why I bought this pen. I bought this pen because I was cu curious about it, I wanted to, to check it, and I also uh, was curious about how these, uh, how these would compare and to make the videos. So, here it is. It has the, that little thing that people talk about. Okay, and then it works. Okay, it looks a fine pen with the clip. Strangely, I didn't see the, the little clip remover that supposedly comes with the pen. I need to check better inside the box, but I didn't see it. So, the, the clip is possible to be removed. There is a plastic piece that will take these out, I think by lifting these little parts on the side. I will not do it now, I have to search for the little tool. So the pen is transparent, the color is called graphite smoke. I cannot tell anything by this. And it has that kind of interesting nib work, sorry it's upside down, where it comes and it lowers that door and then it comes out and clicks in place. It is much bigger than the nib of the, the Pilot. And I, th I think this is an interesting pen. It is removed like that and I think this one is removed, okay, sorry, like this and it comes out and then you can put the the cartridge or a converter if you have one inside the pen and lock it like that. Then you can put it on place like this. I think you need to go all the way down like that and it is locked in place again. So we can close it and the pen is ready to go. So this is an interesting color of an interesting pen. I find this design quite nice. I'm very curious about trying this. I only have very cheap platinum pens like the, the Plaisir and the, the Preppy, but let's try this one and I'll let you know very soon what I think about it. So, you already know these pens came from Fontana Pena, if you want check them out because they are a very nice store and they ship from Europe and this is good thing because in Europe we don't pay the taxes 
for inside the European Union and it's good for people who are outside because they will not pay, pay that tax. So that's a good thing also. And I think this is all that I had to, sh to tell you today. You will see me soon working with this pen and if you find one like this but in blue, please let me know. I hope you enjoyed the video and see you soon. Bye.